importance of light in photosynthesis. To do the experiment we require a potted plant, boiling tube, iodine, petri dish, methylated spirit or alcohol, distilled water, forceps, Bunsen burner, Take a healthy potted plant and keep it for 2 to 3 days in a dark place. Take two uniform pieces of black paper. Select a healthy destarched leaf and cover a portion of the leaf on both sides by using these two uniform pieces of black paper. Now, place the potted plant in sunlight for the whole day. Pluck the covered leaf in the late afternoon. Remove the black paper from the leaf. Take a beaker containing distilled water, place it over a Bunsen burner and boil it. Put the experimental leaf into the boiling water and boil for 5 to 10 minutes till the leaf becomes soft. Remove the beaker from the tripod stand and allow it to cool for some time. Take another beaker containing distilled water and place it over a Bunsen burner and boil it to about 60 degrees. Take the bottle containing alcohol and pour it into a clean boiling tube. Place the boiling tube into the beaker containing water that is boiling. Take the leaf from the beaker using a forceps. Place the leaf into the boiling tube containing alcohol. Keep the boiling tube in the beaker till the leaf becomes colourless. Take the leaf from the boiling tube using forceps. Dip the leaf in a beaker containing distilled water and wash it. Place the leaf in a petri dish. Take iodine solution using a dropper. Drop a few drops of iodine solution on the leaf. Observation After iodine treatment, the color of the exposed portion of the leaf turns blue-black, while the unexposed portion of the leaf turns pale yellow. Conclusion Starch is one of the end products of photosynthesis and turns blue-black on contact with iodine. The exposed portion of the leaf that turns blue-black shows photosynthetic activity while the unexposed portion shows the reverse. This indicates that light is essential for photosynthesis.